I'm going to show you other uses for peach pepper jam and pineapple pepper jam besides just pouring it over cream cheese and having with crackers because there's so much you can do with this. Here I am rolling whole water chestnuts with a half a piece of bacon and sticking a toothpick through it. I'll get this whole can of water chestnuts rolled and then I will put it in the air fryer. I've set it in the air fryer spaced out. I will set at 400 degrees and I'll set it for seven minutes. It says six. I actually went back and added a minute. Here they are after seven minutes. I will turn them all so they get evenly cooked. I will reset it for 400 once again after they're all turned and I will cook another seven minutes. After the seven, after the 14 total minutes, take them out. Here's just for my family. I'm putting it on a paper plate with the peach pepper jam in the middle. These are delicious. My brother is here trying to get his hand in the way. Look at him. These are delicious. You will enjoy these. Here's the last two. They went after them like vultures. Next, I took some raw shrimp and I added about a half a jar of my pineapple pep pepper jam and stirred them up and, and then put them in a hot pan. The oil I'm using is sesame oil. I'm adding a little bit of salt, no pepper because of the jam already has this little spice to it. And then I'll cook these until they're done, making sure that they're all cooked evenly on both sides. And that's all I did to the, the shrimp and it was delicious. Then I took these three seasonings, tossed it on the shrimp and at 400 degrees, put the shrimp in the air fryer, three minutes on each side, three minutes, shake, three more minutes. Here is what the, fry, the fried ones look like or the sauteed ones. Here are the ones that came out of the air fryer that I will dip in the peach pepper jam and there's pineapple pepper jam on there as well. Next I took a little bit, little pieces of grouper and I pan fried them with some light coating and here I'm going to take the grouper bites with a little bit of muscadine jelly and my peach pepper jam for dips and this was a delicious meal. We made a meal off of all of this delicious seafood.